What up, dogs? Cool. So, we're going to talk about the weekend. The weekend is just another two days, but we've been programmed and conditioned to see it as this massive binge fest of all sorts of varieties. And they all, they're all good. They're all damn good. I'm not questioning that. However, if you're someone who is really genuinely trying to change your body, change how you feel, and be more consistently happy, I put it to you this. You need to sacrifice instant gratification for long-term gain. So, it's not about living like a monk or a nun and kind of like cutting everything out of your life. But you need to understand that like, there's less that you can get away with in your current situation. Yeah, you need to kind of go through a process of resetting everything, getting everything back online, getting yourself further down the line in terms of your goals, and then you can then sparingly put these things in and enjoy them so much more because, you know, they really are well earned and, um, you know, they've been deserved. And I, you know, I know sometimes we can justify things like, oh, I deserve this because I've had a hard day in work. And I've deserved this because this week has been a bitch. You know, and you know, yeah. Sometimes we deserve an escape because it's been too, it's been too difficult. However, in terms of your fitness goals, body, body aesthetics, or whatever, no way. So, do try and limit, limit the damage, so that you start on Monday ahead and not behind, because it's the chasing your tail that. It, um, that's sort of, is the antidote to the motivation. Yeah, because you don't see the results and you think, well, what's the point? What's the point? The point is this, go through, go through the barriers, destroy the obstacles, and keep moving forward. <laughs> Peace.